What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, a new direction of modern men. And today's video, I'm going to basically be reviewing Shea Moisture's beard conditioning oil. So this is my first time to be using it on camera for you guys. So you guys get my live reaction. You guys will see the price point. You guys will give you my background of beard oils and beard conditioning oils. And let's get into this video. So if this is your first time on Arcway, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. Also hit the bell so you guys get the latest content updates on this channel. And let's begin this. I haven't really experimented in doing deep conditionings for too long, but this is an oil that they do provide by Shea Moisture, and this is actually gonna help you smell good, look good, essentially with your beard, but at the same time, keep it hydrated. So keeping your beard hydrated on a consistent basis is something that we all need to do. So this highlight product is gonna be beneficial for me, it's gonna be beneficial for you guys. So I'm gonna give you my reaction, I'm gonna test it out, and let's begin. This is the beard conditioning oil. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pour like a dime size on my hand or so. The substance of this is quite thin as it is. It's not as heavy as Jamaican castor oil where I've shown in the videos before, where it comes a little more thicker. This is kind of a little bit looser. So I'm gonna put this into my hand, give it a smell. It smells like almonds. So the beard conditioning oil, just rub it into my beard and let's go from there. I'm gonna actually focus on under my beard because for me, that's where this, my beard is actually the driest and I realize I don't take care of that area enough. So I'm gonna give it a little extra attention. It does feel a lot more hydrated because I kind of massaged it in there with my fingertips. At the same time, I haven't really used a lot of conditioning oil to actually penetrate my beard throughout my whole day. So having this is actually gonna be very beneficial for me, especially in the climate, and depending where you live, out here in Canada, when it does come into winter times, you're gonna need beard conditioning oil because it gets a lot more colder. So quick tip, what I usually do with my beard oils is when I do put it into my hand, I rub it around, use my fingertips to penetrate my beard to the basically at the base of the follicles on my hair. So at the end of the day, you can grow my hair, moisturize, and keep it replenished and healthy. So for me, at the end of the day, I'll probably use this more often in the winter time when it comes into the spring and summer, I'll probably ease off on it. So if you guys are interested in purchasing Shea Moisture, you guys can actually purchase it on the link down below. I'll link it just for you guys. You can purchase it at Walmart where I picked it up at for about 11 bucks. But on the website, you can actually get direct from them. So to me, this is actually a really good beard conditioning oil. This will probably be in my top three. I have no complaints with this. For the price point of it, it is good. For the consistency and how much you do get out of it, it's gonna last you a while. So let me know if you guys actually tried this beard conditioning oil. Let me know if you guys have experienced anything from Shea Moisture's collection for men. Yet again, guys, thank you guys so much for watching Arcway, a new direction of a modern man. If you guys wanna see more of these beard type of videos, put in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys wanna see. Subscribe to the channel, give it a big thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Peace.